What's going on my PT peeps? One Eye Bri back to talk about The Walking Dead and which side are you on? Team Negan or Team Rick? It's a fun discussion. There's no right or wrong answers, but I just am interested to see which side you are and why. So post your comments below and I just want to know your thoughts about this because it tells a lot of which side you're on of <laughs> your character, I guess. No, I'm just kidding. But it's just a fun way discussion to have. I myself I've always been Team Rick, and not even for the fact of Rick Grimes, it's the team, the team aspect of it. I like more of Rick characters than Negan's characters, but Rick is cool. Negan brings more to the table than the show has let on. If you know the comics, he's far better in the comics. Hopefully it'll pick up better on the show, but Negan is <laughs> a complex character. We would just say that. Jeffrey Dean Morgan's rendition of Negan is good. I like Jeffrey Dean Morgan, but it's just the character alone it has to be watered down for the show because he swears way too much in the comics. Rick, Daryl, Michonne, Carol, you know, there's so many big characters on Rick's side that it's hard for me not to like Rick and definitely like Negan over Rick. Now, I don't know if the story was following Negan from the very beginning, would you like Negan over Rick? It's hard to say and hard to, hard to know because that'll be never answered, but it's one of those questions that if you follow the person from the very beginning, is that our side? Like if you follow Tony Soprano on The Sopranos, he's not the best guy, but he's the guy that you follow and you kind of have on your side as like, I have to root for him because he's the main protagonist of the show and the main character. And that's an interesting thought of it there too. Negan has some secondary characters that you might like, like Simon myself. I like Simon the best out of all the secondary characters of the Saviors and Negan. Gavin's okay. Jared's terrible. A rat annoying. You know, David was just terrible. Gary terrible. You know, like there's just Gregory is team Negan for sure. I guess he's playing both sides, but I would say he's team Negan terrible. It's just there's so many characters that would be there. You would have to be Team Negan just for Negan, but you can be Team Rick for a variety of reasons like Rick or Carl or Carol or somebody else. But Jadis, I don't know if you would say she's Team Negan or Team Rick. She's independent contractor out there. She's a free agent, but I would say the way the last time we saw her, she was definitely Team Negan, that's for sure, which <laughs> I'm not going to like that by any means. But Rick brings a lot to the table. You know, he's made some bad decisions, tough decisions. Hasn't always been the best leader, but he's been a good leader. Negan, I would say, has done some crazy things over the top, but he is a good leader for protection and survival. My favorite character is Michonne. Michonne is going to be my favorite character through the entire series, and so I'm going to be Team Rick just for that simple aspect because she's on his side, of course. So she's awesome for a variety of reasons. You got Jerry on Rick's side now, too. I mean, come on. There's just so many people on Rick's side that you got to like, you got to love. And I know it's unfair because there's so many good or great characters on Rick's side. And we've had more of Rick than Negan. We've only had really one season of Negan. Shiva gets added to Rick's side, Jerry, Ezekiel, even Dwight's coming over to that side too. That's something being said when one of Negan's lieutenants or right-hand men are coming over and it's like weird that Negan's losing his peeps. So there's something to be said, even Team Negan isn't Team Negan. But the four women here are the strongest women I've seen on television for a long time, which is awesome. And I love to see all these women survive and thrive. I love all them as their characters are, and the actresses are great too. Carol and Daryl alone are better than all of Negan's people. So, you know, Negan versus Rick, who do you got? And it's going to be unfair because you know Rick's going to win in the war. I mean, there's just no way. Good has to triumph over evil, right? Even though Negan is semi-evil, he's partial evil. But I don't know if it's <laughs> that big a deal if you like one side or another. Hopefully you just like the show for what it is. But give me some reasons why you would like Negan. You know, is it because he's a bad boy and chicks like a bad boy? They like the leather. They like the beard. They like the look. They like that you never know what he's going to do. Would you really want to be Negan's wives and be used like that if you were in this world? I doubt it, right? I mean, you don't have value and worth. And that's not, that's no way to live in the world of The Walking Dead or our world. So what do you think, guys? Team Rick team Negan post your comments below let me know which team you are and why there's no right or wrong answers it's just a fun discussion so there you go guys check out my books on amazon.com barnesandnoble.com fight for us 
the beginning and reunited its books one and two. We got a link to the first book in the description. We got a link to the first book in the Instagram. And if you follow me on Instagram, I'm at the PT channel on Twitter as well. Books one and two are available now. Working on book three as we speak. Can't wait to finish that hopefully by October. Check out the Walking Dead community page on Facebook. We have a page and a group. And as always, guys, hit that subscribe button. Help us achieve our goal of 100,000 subscribers. We can't do without you guys. Stay in the know by subscribing. You guys are awesome, and thank you for watching.